Hey folks, Crazy Climber 80 here again, and we're going to look at a game called Space Fury, and uh, its sequel was called Zector, or Zector. This game was created by Gremlin Sega in 1981, and it is the first color vector game. Uh, there's not too much else about it that was that I thought was particularly good. There are some cool voice samples. Um, some kind of cool power-ups, but I didn't think the game was all that great. I found it very repetitive and kind of dull. But uh, this game is largely remembered because of its uh, big-headed alien that taunts you before uh, each round. And uh, there are four rounds, well, maybe four levels per round, we'll, we'll call it that. Or no, uh, excuse me, three. But uh, for each level, you get to pick out a weapon upgrade. And uh, there are three different weapon upgrades. Does anyone dare challenge my Imperial fleet? <laughs> and there's the alien. Um, he makes an appearance at the end of Zector, or Zector, the sequel to this. But uh, he, he taunts you before the start of each level. And uh, he has uh, about five different sayings. Uh, maybe a couple more than that. But basically, you spend each level trying to destroy the enemies as quick as you can. And there will be spaceships formating into a large ship. And you want to try to prevent them from formating into a larger ship. Just try to pick them off as quickly as you can, and then you'll get bonus points for time left. And uh, there's one of the uh, powered-up ships. Some enemies will be able to pass through the wings of your ship. Some enemies will kill you by touch, and uh, the enemies will also shoot at you. And uh, sometimes their bullets will be able to pass through the wings of your ship. And sometimes they'll be able to touch it and kill you. So, a creature for my amusement. Prepare for battle. Okay, let's get started. Here you're in this wussy little ship. Just want to destroy the enemies as quickly as you can. Then you get a dock into one of three. And uh, if you don't dock in time... You just thrust into the so, ship. You defeated my scouts. Well, my cruisers will destroy you. <laughs> See, you just gotta pick off the enemies as quickly as you can. There's a bonus timer at the top. If it runs down to zero, you have to start over on this uh, on this level here. So you just gotta quickly pick them off. This green uh, this green upgrade is three way, one shot for each way. And sometimes the, the particles can pass completely through you. It depends on the enemy. Now I'm going to take the dark you blue one. Me, that I is, uh, that is my favorite one. You. It's three bullets per shot straight. And that helped me end that level real quick. And now this uh, light blue one gives you two, sh two shots behind you at once. And then one straight ahead. That you can wrap around with your shots or fly right through and reappear on the other side. Just depends on the enemy whether or not they, that they can fly through the wings of your ship. At this point on, I don't think there are any, any enemies that can fly right through the center of you. Yeah, once you once you use up all the all the docking parts, then. Uh, then you start with a new set. <laughs> from, uh, from this point on, the game is really repetitive, and you have to, the enemies formate so quickly that you don't really have time to uh, destroy them quickly enough to end the level, it seems. It's just, it's just, it's just kind of lame. I, I don't really care for this game that much. Um... At this point, just just shoot the enemies as quickly as you can and try to get a good enough score. If you're able to get, like, I think over 20,000 or so, you'll get the best congratulatory message at the end of your game from the boss, or from the, uh, 
the alien that taunts you. Yeah, you, you just need to try to keep them from formating as quickly as you can so that you'll be able to end the level and and uh, the bonus remaining at the top is what will be uh, awarded to you once you uh, dock with a uh, with a weapon upgrade but uh, yeah this game really isn't that great in my opinion that number under your score indicates how many times you've uh, you've uh, used up all the all the weapon upgrades and passed around I'm just I'm just not a fan of this game but yeah, just battle is completed warrior you were an outstanding opponent yeah that's the best uh, message you can get is outstanding now I put in my initials but uh, yeah I'm not a big fan of this game um, just just kind of maybe know what enemies can pass through you, uh, pass through your wings, and what enemies can't pass through you. And uh, their, their shots, uh, some, uh, sometimes you can shoot them. Um, of the three upgrades, yeah, the dark blue one is best. Fires three bullets straight ahead. Um, just keep turning it and eliminating the uh, the parts that are trying to formate as quickly as you can. Try not to let them formate, and uh, that strategy will end the level quicker. The green again is a three-way one-shot left, right, and forward, and then the light blue is two bullets per shot behind and one in front. But I like the the dark blue upgrade best. But that is Space Fury by Gremlin Sega in 1981, the first color vector game. And its sequel was called Zector or Zector. Well, this is Crazy Climber 80 saying thanks for watching Space Fury by Gremlin Sega in 1981. And I'll catch you later with another video in the near future. See you then, folks. Bye-bye.